Senator Michael Bennett in a statement on Sunday. The aid package proposed to Ukraine should be approved without negotiations at the U.S.-Mexican border. During a view of CBS on Face National, Bennett said that moderator Margaret Brennan realized that he and his Senate colleagues should include financing for Ukraine for proposed financing request from Biden administration. Last month, the White House, Israel, Ukraine and Taiwan for money humanitarian aid and border security measures, including approximately $106 billion of national security funding request, and before that. Bennett said to Brennan in the last few days with Republicans. He said that he had made good conversations in the last few days. Of course, I believe that people of Ukraine have won a vote to support them without negotiating at the U.S. border. But there are others who feel different in Senate. This says that when the deputies on both sides hold their heads over the proposed aid package, GOP MPs should be packaged with a proposed aid package to Ukraine. Some parliamentary Republicans shared their opposition to approves more assistance to Ukraine, which has fought with neighboring Russia for nearly two years. Last month, the Parliament Republicans have exceeded a 14.3 billion aid package for Israel, who is currently fighting the militant group Hamas. Bennett also told Brennan that U.S. has the obligation to continue to support Ukraine in war against Russia and that it was a sea fight for democracy. And I don't know if the House is enough for them. My opinion is always a place to make our immigration system better on behalf of the American people. And I hope that well-intentioned people can come together and reach a solution.